In this video, I'll show you how to rig any character using the IK rig in Prisma 3D. Usually, rigging a character is straightforward. You import a single object character, click on Rig, add the IK rig, and align the bones to each joint. Simple, right? But what if your character is made up of multiple objects, like the one on screen now? That's where things get a little different. And I'm going to show you exactly how to handle it. First, make sure your character is centered at the origin point, with the feet slightly above it. Also, ensure the character is in a proper T-pose. Import a sphere and scale it down so it's smaller than your character. Then, duplicate the sphere and place one at each joint of the body. There are roughly 15 joints to cover. To accurately place each sphere, parent the sphere to a body part. For example, the foot. then reset its position to zero. After that, unparent it. Repeat this process for all the joints. Once all spheres are placed, group them together and apply the IK rig to the group. Then align each bone to the corresponding sphere. Set the transparency of the spheres to zero, so they're invisible. You should now only see the bone. Now, bring back your character model. Now, attach each body part to its corresponding bone. The foot goes to the foot bone, the upper leg to the upper leg bone, and so on. Do this for the entire body. Once that's done, your character is fully rigged and ready for animation. You can now add colors or textures to your model and start animating. That's it for this tutorial. If you'd like a full breakdown tutorial on how to create a character, rig it, and animate it from start to finish, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.